Hey everyone, my name is Tori and today I'm going to be doing X Mondo Colors in Garnets. I'm going to be dyeing my natural hair. I first started with my natural hair because I watched his video of him trying it on dark brown hair and I figured I would try it on mine. So first what I'm doing is saran wrapping my hand because I didn't have gloves and I did not know this was a hack okay i thought maybe some grocery bags or a ziploc but you know did that and now i am dyeing my hair and as you see i'm trying out the different lighting settings but it's kind of hard to see no matter what i did for the lighting settings because my hair is so dark and that is me just rubbing it in getting it all up in there I tried to speed through some of this footage because I ended up having to bleach my hair. So I'm just showing you how I did it. I massaged it in my head and that's how it's looking. And it kind of turned out like this chestnut red brownie color. Um, I thought it was pretty cute, but I kind of wanted a more vibrant look to it. And also I feel like it just dyed my scalp more than my actual hair. But maybe I didn't apply enough of it. So next I'm going in with the Salon Care in the Developer 20. And the Quick Blue Powder Bleach. And wrapping my, <laughs> wrap my hand again. Because why not? And here I go with the bleach. I did not have any brushes so I kind of just smooshed it in my hair but I figure since my hair is so short that I can just use my hand and it'd be fine. I tried not to directly massage it into my scalp um, but just try to get as much as I could. I mean it's so short that I figured it wouldn't be that damaging and also I only did one uh I only bleached it once so I figured that my scalp wouldn't get too wrecked. And whenever it gets to this length of me growing out a buzz cut, I feel like it just gets so boring and I need to add some color to it. So this is probably like the eighth time I've shaved my head. And yeah, so I'm wrapping it with saran wrap, hopefully trying to insulate the heat. And then it's at this yellowy color. So I'm like, that's going to be fine because it's a red. So, and there goes the satisfying color. Oh yeah, right up in there. It's like this dark red. It's so rich and it actually did smell amazing and there were little sparkles in it. So it was pretty amazing getting it all in there and you can really just apply it like a conditioner. Just get it all up in there. And as you can see from the back, I didn't really bleach it that even. Obviously, you can see my neck hair is a different color, but the the color ended up being pretty dark on my head. So you couldn't tell that much that I missed any spots. And I wanted to do this color because it is coming into the fall time and I wanted something to more to stand out with, you know, kind of want to look like a fall leaf falling from a tree. I thought it looked pretty cute though. And this is the finished product. I was really happy with how it turned out and I feel like it makes my face glow more. So yeah, 10 out of 10, recommend 
Thank you, Brad Mondo, again for creating these beautiful colors.